Hello, we're watching the new Knuckles show starring Idris Elba. If you guys want us to watch more Knuckles, then get this video to 13,000 likes. And we'll also watch Sonic 3 if this video hits 15,000 likes. Check out the Patreon for the uncut recording and also a bunch of exclusive content. We're doing two series right now. We're doing Total Drama Revenge of the Island and Avatar The Last Airbender. And if you chuckle, subscribe. Also, we have a plushie out right now. Click the link in the top of the description. You can buy this beautiful product. Makeshift did a great job with the design, so I hope you guys enjoy it. It's only available till May 22nd, so buy it before it's gone forever. Hell yeah, bro. Remember when the first movie was about to come out and no one thought that, like, the series would last? Like, they were like, all right, it's doomed from the start. And then they realized Sonic fans will watch literally anything. They're so desperate for content that they'll buy Sonic Forces day one. I know what you're thinking. No way they started with I know what you're thinking. Is Sonic gonna gas Knuckles up? He's like, bro, you gotta hear about this guy. He's so cool. Okay, I love Ben Schwartz. So I'll hear you say anything, Ben. Which might be harder than it sounds. A new record. <laughs> what if that's the only line Idris Elba says in the entire show? They only pay him for one line. <laughs> Dude, Knuckles looks so out of place there. That was such a funny pan. The proportions are so strange. Like, his head is, like, bigger than their entire torso, yet he's, like, half their size. Is he killing them? This is, like, over the head when he's just, like, breaking in. I just have to say, this guy is giving a crazy performance. Like, he is going so hard. No, this is, like, the weirdest part about all the new Sonic live-action shit. Is that, like, why are the live-action actors actually, like, good? Like, that's, like, the last thing you would expect from this. He's a really big kid with a huge imagination. Thinks he's a warrior. He is a warrior, bro. You're trying to discriminate on his culture? Dude, Eggman literally scrapped him away from his culture and threw him here, bro. It's like, my kid don't chuckle. <laughs> Oh my god, he loves Cool Ranch! He loves Cool Ranch Doritos! There's nothing like the taste of Cool Ranch of Doritos. Oh my god, I can't even make the joke because he just says it. I enjoy product placement. There's nothing like the taste of Cool Ranch Doritos. Would you like to try some? You can find them in your local Walmart. Cool Ranch is gas, though. I kind of want some now. Ah, oh, boy. Poor guys. Oh, they're in the show. I didn't realize they were going to be in the show. They look so dirty. Yeah, give them a shower. Yeah, throw them in the washing machine. <laughs> Tails would die in the washing machine. Knuckles is just having a little trouble adjusting to his new home. It wasn't easy for me to understand this planet at first either. Why does Ben Schwartz make Sonic sound so gay? <laughs> Sonic is gay. Take one look at the audience for Sonic, and you might realize the reason. Being a Sonic fan and straight is literally like the, the meme where it's like being straight in a world where being gay is the norm. Come on, Ozzy. Yeah. Good boy. I think that was a real dog. Yeah, it, well, 100%. I didn't doubt it for a second. Like in modern movies now, even for really simple stuff, they will CG the animals and it looks so weird. If you CG the animals, then no one can harm them. Well, it, it's harming our eyes with the terrible CGI. Maybe those animals should make the sacrifice for the greater good. I think so too. Robotnik's gone and there's no new battle to fight. Yeah, we're just waiting for him to show up again for the third movie. You, Rouge the Bat's gotta be in it, right? Oh my God, don't even get me started, bro. If they want to make a billion dollars in the box office they better put rouge the bat in it taylor Swift's voice is rouge the bat it's ice spice you dumbass she's like i am rouge the bat i am going to steal things and be attractive gra good morning <gasps> what is that it is merely the seat that designates my role as family champion this is just fan fiction them at home they're playing house right now they literally are playing house this feels a lot like the sonic shows we've seen this feels like a sonic boom plot the knuckles and sonic boom is peak knuckles yeah for sure that was probably the best part of sonic boom I swear to God, some of the humor in this franchise feels like it comes out of like a Smosh video or something. And then you cut to credits, executive producer. Ian Hecox. Think about it. Echidnas, what do they have? Multiple cocks. All right, Wade. You got this. You will bowl a strike 
right now. Oh, this guy. This is the funny, funny guy. I, who is this? He's the funny cop. Funny. Sorry, I'm doing quotation marks. This is what the Swahili tribesmen call Kufafa Nuawakati. Kufafa Nuawakati. A defining moment. Kor would dice this guy in bowling. He's so good at bowling. I feel like if I went bowling with Kor, he'd break all of his bones while playing. I don't know why. No, we were we played bowling a couple months ago and he fucking destroyed us in bowling. It was fucking crazy. Oh, you guys went bowling in Japan? In Niagara Falls. Where's the gif of the, the bowling ball in the pen? Joe, relax, bro. I don't need to be reminded that that exists. <laughs> Remember that when that was like in the replies to every tweet for some reason? Now it's just a bowling ball AI saying, you want to fill my holes? Pins in bio. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to need to collect your bowling shot. I don't mean to be an asshole because I do enjoy the human scenes in this franchise, but I would be really interested to see like a time comparison of time that Sonic characters are not on screen versus on screen. I saw a tweet where it was like Knuckles is only in 30% of the show or something. Well, I guess because they don't want to pay for all the visual effects shots. Yeah, the animation's like way more expensive than just recording live action. How's it going? Leave me be, Hedgehog. I took your advice and now I lay banished on the floor of shame. This looks good. Like, the lighting in this shot is fucking awesome. Yeah, the way Sonic was spreading it there, man, I was fucking with that shot. There's, like, absolutely no drop in quality from the movie to the TV show. Like, this looks just as good as the movie. They have come a long way since the 90s. Ah, where have you sent me? Oh, oh my god, he's doing TikToks. My oh my god, he's doing TikToks. God. Dude, I can't believe Sonic got the Apple Vision Pro, though. I can't believe they can afford that in this household. He's gonna hop on VR chat and play as Uganda Knuckles. <laughs> it's like, that voice is actually kind of offensive, Sonic. Dude, the show would blow up so much as a meme if they did that. Do you know the way? Do you know the way? Uh, assassin! Relax, Knuckles. It's me. Wait, who is this? This is Knuckles' grandpa. No, the voice. The voice. It's Christopher Lloyd? Christopher Lloyd is so old at this point that he can only play people that look like this. In the ways of the echidna. Teach him our customs. Oh, because he's the last of his line. He has to keep the people going. He's got to use those cocks one way or another. But he, if he's the last of the echidna, he's going to have to interbreed. But with Wade Whipple. It's time to get ripped. Why are you benching that? This is your fur. Oh my God, bro. No spot. Motherfucker is benching so much. I come to you. With an urgent need. I come to you because you are working out without a squatter. I will spot you. I will make you a true warrior. This is the same thing like Ted series. You know, that's what they should do. This show should just be Wade and Knuckles getting high every day. Let the hedgehogs and Echidna smoke weed. Paramount, please. Dude, I want Knuckles to meet up with Ted. All right, that checks out. Let's do this. Destiny awaits. <laughs> 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 okay, that was kind of good. All right. The warrior training road trip is officially official. It's just a road trip movie. 90% of the Sonic movies have been road trip movies. I don't want a fucking road trip show. It's all they know how to do at this point. They're like, it worked once. Let's do it 49 more times. Or, or music. Yes. The hedgehog spoke of this earth music. Do you have Carti B? What song are they going to play, please? Wet ass pussy. Wet ass pussy. Everyone at the station loves these. I send out a link every Monday. Yes, you can. Can I? Okay. <laughs> I don't. Hey, watching him sing along with it, I don't want to like the song anymore. I don't know if I could listen to this song again. But actually, no, this pisses me off because Knuckles should be into hip hop. I feel like that's a big part of his character's aesthetic. My name's Knuckle. I don't chuckle. Yeah, what the fuck is that? Like, they literally have the Knuckles rap. He's black. Knuckles is black. Agent Willoughby. Got a problem. Kid Cudi! I forgot Kid Cudi's in the show. Kid Cudi just plays like a secret agent trying to kill Knuckles or something. I heard a mushroom planet is beautiful this time of year, my friend. Enjoy! <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure Kid Cudi really loves Sonic, so like that's why he's in this. Sonic is like more autistic Muppets. It's like there's a lot of famous people who would like really fuck with being in this. <laughs> you cannot train for battle without first knowing your battleground. Hmm, you want to see my battleground? This is literally like GTA 4, like, Nico, do you want to go bowling? This whole show is just a GTA 4 bowling mission for six episodes. Many a battle has been won and lost between these very lanes. Plus, 
Bowling is a beautiful game. What is this fucking bowling propaganda? Bowling is a beautiful game, Court. I don't know what you're trying to fucking say. Smash those pins with no mercy. I'm beginning to understand your interest in this game. Knuckles can't play bowling. He he he, wear, he doesn't have fingers. He can just grab it by his palm, bro. <laughs> he just picks up the bowling ball and throws it. Yeah, no, he could just throw that shit. Oh, awesome. We got here just in time. Can we talk about how no one in the bowling alley has came up to approach Knuckles since he entered? I mean, it's been normalized in their society. It's a very tolerant society. I don't think it is at this point. This is like new. Kid Cuddy appears out of the bowling alley. Like, what the? What are we watching? He looks sick. He has crazy gloves. What the fuck? Dude, I like this show so far. I'm having fun. I'm like actually having fun watching this. Bro, just shoot <laughs> open firing in the middle of the bowling alley. There is children around. That's so funny, bro. Oh my god, Kid Cudi versus Knuckles. This is a, the next death battle. There's definitely someone who made a comic like 12 years ago where Kid Cudi fights Knuckles and they're just like absolutely frothing at the mouth right now. They're like, no way it actually happened. Knuckles! Oh my god, use the bowling balls. Oh my god. What an amazing set piece for the fight. <laughs> Motherfuckers throwing bowling balls at the woman. That's, That's so crazy. crazy. Whoa, you see that? She fucking rocket jumped, bro. Video game logic. Freddy W about to fucking like sue this fucking movie, dude. You can't be rocket jumping and all your shit. Do something. I told you this was a battlefield. It is kind of crazy, the level of production for this generally, that they didn't just release a movie. Yeah. They could have made this a little shorter and made it Knuckles the movie and released it in theaters and people would have gone to see it. I am in a kingdom. Whoa! Why is like for Sonic fans, like the only thing they can't get is a good game. Why is that the one thing that they just can't get? I think Frontiers was okay. That's not a good game. It's not a good game. It's a great game. <laughs> you have an incredibly dumb idea. Wow, that was a good first episode, man. Holy shit. Oh, that's directed by uh, the guy who directed the Sonic movies. No fucking way, Re really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was sarcastic. No. How is Wade gonna save Knuckles? He can barely throw a bowling ball. Like, how is he supposed to catch up and defeat Kid Cudi? But Wade believes in himself. That's the beautiful thing about this series. It shows that if you believe in yourself, even if you are an unattractive, overweight man in his 30s who hasn't accomplished anything, you can be best friends with Knuckles from Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> Imagine how many Sonic fans wish they were in this position. They have Knuckles all to themselves inside a little cage, and he can't get out. They could do all sorts of their little twisted experiments on him. I I'll be fucking him Knuckles style, bro. I am visualizing my inevitable escape. Oh, he's manifesting. He's manifesting. I'm manifesting my escape. You are such a tourist, Kid Cudi. I'm gonna go relax. Job's done. And we about to get paid. <laughs> What is he? He's such a little goofy goober. Oh my god, they're playing holding up for a hero, walking into the 7-Eleven, Talkies product placement. We're fucking living large, bro. Yo, what? Yo, this that is was awesome. such a hard match cut. That was such a cool cut. The Knuckles show is actually good. This Yo, <laughs> no. The body he double. The, oh that's my, so the, funny. The body that's double so, so funny. funny. This is the best fucking show ever made, bro. Holy shit. I'm having so much fun watching this. Wait, is this going to be like a dream sequence or something? Or is this actually happening? Of course it is. This is definitely his imagination. Yeah. Oh my god, he did the spin! He did the spin jump! The human did the spin jump. You are truly an amazing warrior, Wade with <laughs> I love this so much. The fantasy. Wade is just like millennial Sonic fan self-insert character. This series needed someone like that, and he did it. He filled that niche. Is that what you think? That I'm nothing? That I'm no one. She's so creepy. She's like if they if they stretched out uh, Edna from Incredibles till she was like a normal sized person. <laughs> the glass is cracked. The oil spills on him. The oil, no. Over, 
Oh my <laughs> god, oh my god. <laughs> The fireworks were supposed to be the grand finale! He sounded a lot like Chris Pratt when he said that line. His character is kind of similar to Parks and Rec. Oh yeah, he's like Andy for sure. Oh, They're like, yo, we are not getting our money back on this Airbnb deposit. Shit, bro, the cleaning fee is gonna be crazy. <laughs> little pig, little pig, where are you? <laughs> <laughs> yo, he needs to sample something he says in this show. <laughs> Why is he still crawling? I love him. Bro is so submissive. I fuck with Wade Heavy now. I'm not gonna lie. It is funny that we've come around on him so much because I feel like I remember we just shitted on this character so hard when we watched the movie. I would never shit on Wade. I think you're lying. <laughs> Editor, can you cut to the Sonic video? I will tell people about this. He was literally smiling while saying the line. Yeah, like, he had a full <laughs> smile as he said that it's line. It's just like, it's so <laughs> bad. The acting though, no, it's, it's just one take. That never happened. One second. One second. Kanye's calling. No, I will not be in your Yeezy porn video, Kanye. I don't care how much you're gonna pay me. I'm not gonna fuck a girl in a ghost costume. I'm not gonna see that. And that's why I signed up for Gun. Wait, Gun is in the games, I think. Aren't they? Guns? Gun, like the organization. Shadow has a gun. They're in uh, Sonic Adventure 2. Oh, it's Sonic Adventure 2, really? Yes, Gun killed Maria. Wait, Kid Cudi's gonna kill Maria? Dude, what if Kid Cudi murders Maria, dude? From the warrior known only as Wade. <laughs> Bro, the vine boom there. The vine <laughs> boom. Editor has to keep the Keep the vine boom, please. Thought it'd be dead by now. It's his first day. But yeah, there has been a lot, like a lot less knuckles in this episode than the first episode. And I feel like it's just gonna get less and less as we go forward. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not the cleaning fee. I'm hugging you, as is your celebratory tradition, is it not? I can't believe Wade just fucking, like, destroyed these two. Like, he's the GOAT. See, that's the beautiful thing. All it takes is one Sonic fan to make a difference. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> the E.T. Because he does glide, but, like, when you see it like this, you're like, wait, does this, this doesn't make sense. How does Knuckles glide? <laughs> Yo, that was honestly a, like a very satisfying shot to look at. I can't just drive us. There's no keys. <laughs> okay, I can just drive us. <laughs> He's so fucking cool. I love Knuckles. I love Grand Theft Auto. It's a Ford this time. Okay, so they got a different car, so there is no car placement. Every car manufacturer sponsored this show. I think after all that running, we deserve... A little snack, what do you say, bud? Oh my god. Bro's about to have a fucking cardiac arrest. Lay's potato chips have an ass. Wait, why are you having Lay's potato chips with your burger? And you he has fries. They got fries and potato chips. Can we just talk about that they escaped their evil mansion? Then they went to the burger place down the street. <laughs> <laughs> that cannot be good optics. They're still very close. Green Hills has always just been home. I mean, there must be some place in the universe that's like that for you, right? The temple. The temple, bro. He has to find his floating island, bro. Is that I have been betrayed. Again. And again. And again. And again. Sorry that happened to you. <laughs> that sounded so sincere. Sorry that happened to you. Whatever, asshole. Don't even give a fuck, low key. You gonna eat that? Wait, so he doesn't fuck with rap, but he fucks with rock? Not my knuckles. Not my knuckles. Not my knuckles. Authorities have a manhunt out for a guy named Wade Whipple. You remember this guy? He was- Bro, look at his face! <laughs> okay, this actor be given like the most intense expressions I've ever seen. His expressions are amazing. I love that. That's so funny. First light is broken. We need safe harbor, somewhere we can stay hidden. A bowling alley. I think a bowling alley, to be honest. I don't think they're going to search a bowling alley. <gasps> Hi, Mom. 
Bro, this is the fucking Wade show. This is not the Knuckles show. This wait, 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 wait. If you want to see more Wade, like the video. Aromare, Alex McLean. Alzheimer's is a bad disease. We should cure it. Andrew Husky, Arachnidroid, Aaron Tates, and Atomic Leon Bento, Blake Rivera, Kane Rivers, Tom Luke, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Grenados, Gub Stargazer, Gurney Snile Yernison, Happy and Egg, Helio, Histrionics Ribbler, Honor Pearson, Hummus, Hydropon, Isaiah Alfred, K99, Kamui, King of the Street, Lilac Moon, Loca Pegged, Brett Hand, Michael Rodriguez, Milan Zekanova, Merc, Native, Omega Waffles, Oscar Annis, Pablo the God, Patrick Case Randolph, Pizza Loving Panda, R. Dizel, Rocky Road with Sprinkles, Rathoka, Quinn Christian, Zam, Skyler is Milk's Mama, Kieran Sills, Tyler Russell, Valley Explicit, Victoria.